We lived in Delta from 42 when I was born until 58, and then we moved to 12. But we were there when there was, all the testing was going on because I know lots of friends that's family has applied for the benefits and got them and all that kind of stuff. And we talk about it quite a bit. <laughs> and I've been to several meetings and we just never have applied for it yet. Maybe I should get around to doing it. But it's got to the point now where I'm the oldest one. And guess what? They leave it all on me. <laughs> I had a sister and a brother, or a brother and a sister, and uh, he's four years younger than me. Now he has a disease now that's real rare, <laughs> but I, we don't think it's tied to the cancer or to the testing. You know, uh, he just lost all of his nerves and his arms and everything, and then his muscles disappeared, and he, he went from a state champion butterfly swimmer to a guy in a wheelchair that can't even control his wheels with his arms. But it could be tied to that. But, but, I mean, he was healthy, healthy, but now he's down to that. His, Goal right now is to get his driver's license back. Because right now he cannot even go to the store and get food for himself. He has to go and get to doctors and get stuff. He has to get somebody to give him a ride because he don't have a license. And he's, <laughs> he's doing all the exercises and he's, but personally I don't think so and I don't think he thinks it has, but it might have something to do with this. But I, I, I'm sure they know about it in there. But I don't know. <laughs> we didn't care. We were playing, you know, when you're only, well, about 14 years old when we left. And up till then, we could do what we wanted, but we were outside in it all the time, you know, either helping on the farms, driving tractors or something like that. Not, big physical work and so we were all around but uh, my mother come from a big family and they were all involved in farming down there. there do you know where Topaz is? Okay. They run the big ranch. It was 4,800 acres or something. The fence joined Topaz. That's how close they were to Topaz. So. But Topaz was all gone when his testing went, right? <laughs> they hauled it all into Twill and made houses out of it. I mean, Delden made houses out of it. <laughs> you know, the uh, way I look at it, it, I don't think it affected you until later in your life. You know, you didn't show up, you know. There was no clouds or anything coming through there that I know of. Nobody told us we couldn't play outside, <laughs> you know, which, you know, probably would have been a good idea at that time, you know, but I don't know. <laughs> it, it's kind of funny, I go to, I didn't graduate with them down there. Uh, I'd moved to Twilla, but I go to the class reunions down there with them. It's one of their things we discuss, you know, about couple of days you get talking to all the other people and they say yeah my mom my dad died of cancer and, and some of them have collected on the thing and some haven't some just let it sit like I have done <laughs> I never know of any protest going on about it I, to me I think they didn't really know <laughs> if you want the truth you know I, I don't know. Didn't come out and tell you in the paper go hide underground or anything like that. <laughs> I don't know. My, my feelings is is something that nobody knew it was going on. Nobody come out and says, hey, stay in the house these days or do this or do that. And it just, hey, it's done. It's over with. <laughs> we live with what's left over, you know. I don't know. I... <laughs>
It's, it was just life. <laughs> you don't hear that much of it up here, but they said it didn't get up here to Twilla. It's the things I've read, you know, some of it, the clouds didn't get this far up. I don't know what you know about it or <laughs> what they've done. Everything I can read, if you, if you were in certain areas, you couldn't even apply for the benefits because you weren't here. You know that. And you had to be there in that time frame. Like, now, I've had uncles on both sides and aunts and that, but they all left Delta before the testing was done and never been back. <laughs> so they probably didn't get it, you know. Uh, it's just those of us that stayed till the end, or uh, we stayed till the end. 